हेलो एंड वेलकम टू पाई एजुकेशन दिस इज सुमित चुबे एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अनदर मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट प्रॉब्लम दैट इज बीइंग आस्ट अगेन एंड अगेन इन यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ पुणे एग्जामिनेशन फॉर द सब्जेक्ट सिग्नल एंड सिस्टम सो लेट्स स्टार्ट इन दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन व्हाट हैपेंस इज दैट यू विल बी गिवन आइदर पी डी एफ दैट इज प्रोबेबिलिटी डेंसिटी फंक्शन ऑफ ए रैंडम वेरिएबल और सी डी एफ दैट इज कम्यूलेटिव डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन फंक्शन ऑफ ए रैंडम वेरिएबल एंड यू विल बी आस्क टू फाइंड आउट इफ द सी डी एफ इज गिवन यू विल बी आस्क टू फाइंड आउट पी डी एफ एंड इफ द पी डी एफ इज गिवन यू विल बी आस्क टू फाइंड आउट सी डी एफ ए पार्ट फ्रॉम दैट यू विल बी आस्क टू फाइंड आउट सर्टन प्रोबेबिलिटीज दैट योर रैंडम वेरिएबल it will always be most of the time it is going to be capital x will be between some range as you can see here is our first question and in this question you can see that probability density function of a variable x is given here and you have been asked to find out what will be the cdf so here pdf is given as x e to the power minus x ux and you have been asked to find out cdf you have been asked to find out that the probability that your random variable will be less than equal to x you have been asked to find out that your probability that your random variable between the range 1 to 2 you have been asked to find out that probability that the random variable will be greater than 2 uh, in the second question you have been given the cd of of the random variable capital x and you have been asked to find out what will be the value of k and here k is a constant most often there will be a constant k here okay so the idea here is that uh, you will be given a random variable either with its pdf or cdf and if the pdf or cdf is given you have to use the properties of pdf and cdf that we have discussed in the last lecture to find out different quantities that has been asked in the question these kind of questions has been asked quite frequently i have about 8 to 10 question paper from the last 4 or 5 years and i have seen that in every year these questions has been asked here cdf of a random variable is given so this is our pdf and it has been asked to determine the value of k we already know that one of the properties of uh, cdf is cdf at infinity is equal to 1 now if you apply this property here in this question from question itself it is evident that f of x infinity will be 50k right because uh, f of x x is equal to 50k for x greater than 10 and infinity is certainly greater than 10 so here from this question you can write it like this that it will be equal to 50k now if it is equal to 50k then the value of k will be 1 by 50 and this is very simple to evaluate okay and we are now going to determine the second part that is what will be the probability that random variable will be between the range 4 less than equal to x less than equal to 7 so uh, from the properties of random variable itself this will be equal to capital f of x 7 minus f of x 4 now f of x 7 will be equal to k 7 square minus k 4 square okay so this will be equal to k i can take common and 7 square that is 49 minus 4 square that is 16 and value of k is 1 by 50 so this will be equal to 1 by 50 times 49 minus 16 is 33 so we will get 33 by 50 as our answer now we have to calculate the pdf as cdf is given so pdf is basically a small f of capital x x is equal to differentiation of f of x x d upon dx so since f of x is a piece wise signal we will get a piece wise value here as well so the piece wise value will be so this is going to be 0 for x less than equal to 0 it will be 2k x for x between 0 and 
10 and then after 10 it is again going to be 0 because differentiation of constant is equal to 0. So let's see the second question. Now in this question the probability density function is given and we have been asked to find out the value of constant k here it is given l but it should be k we have been asked to find out the value of k we have been asked to find out cdf these two probabilities now this is again a very simple question all we are going to do is apply the properties of probability density function pdf and we will find out these value so the very first properties of pdf if you remember is that minus infinity to infinity f of x x dx is equal to 1 and if you apply this property here then you will find out that uh, this integration will be minus infinity to 0 if this is 0 basically to 0 dx plus 0 to 1 this is kx square dx plus 1 to 2 kx dx plus 2 to infinity 0 dx will be equal to 1 right will be equal to 1 what value we are getting here so the first part of this integration this will be equal to 0 second part of this integration will be k x cube by 3 and in this case k 1 cube by 3 for the third part we will be getting k x square by 2 and here we will be getting k by 2 and since it is a square we will get 4 minus 1 and this value must be equal to 1 now so here we got k by 3 plus 3k by 2 equal to 1 which in turns will be equal to 2k plus 9k divided by 6 equal to 1 and we got k equal to 6 by 11 so we we were able to solve our first part of our problem now we have to determine what is going to be the cdf now determining cdf is very easy there is a straightforward relation between pdf and cdf and this is that capital f of x x is equal to minus infinity to x small f of capital x x dx uh, since uh, our small f of x that is cdf is a piecewise function we will get a piecewise value here i'm directly going to write it down you can easily determine it it's a very simple integration so this will be equal to k x cube divided by 3 between the range x 0 and 1 okay and the value of k you already know this is 6 by 11 so you can write it down actually then you will get 2 by 11 x cube so the for the second part you will be able to get k x square divided by 2 minus k by 2 and this is for x between 1 and 2 and this is going to be equal to 1 for x greater than equal to 2 okay so this is basically straightforward integration you will be easily able to do it so in the third part we have been basically asked to find out probability that p will be uh, greater than x will be greater than equal to 2 and i can write it that this is equal to 1 minus p less than equal to 2 and you can easily write 1 minus integration of pdf minus infinity to 2 and f of x x dx and you can find out the value here now in the third part fourth part sorry it is given that probability that x is less than 2 and here you can easily get this value by oh sorry it is actually 1 sorry x is less than 1 and this value will be minus infinity to 1 f of x x dx and you can easily get these value as well and here in this case you are going to get k by 3 and k is basically 6 by 11 so you can write down that 2 by 11 this value will be 2 by 11 so with this we are going to conclude this session if you have any problem you can ask me Thank you.